So someone sent me a level and said I couldn't beat it, which meant I had to waste hours proving them wrong, because I never lose. And speaking of never losing, please help us win this subscriber count battle against baby time. We cannot let the babies take over. Anyway, this entire level makes use of this juggling technique where I have to keep all the shells and items in the air without having them collide. It takes a lot of precise button presses and movement control, and you can't make a single mistake to beat the level. So at the start, I throw the spring so Mario can bounce off the coupling, and I juggle the shells while shell jumping over the spikes. I do a drop shell jump and throw the bottom and catch it after this mini shell jump and throw it to activate an on-off switch, and the spring launches this mole and I start another juggle. Now this is the hardest part of the level because it's really hard to get over these spikes with the spring. You'll see I just barely catch each of the items as I try to bring everything closer to the wall. And here, I kick the shell as I spring jump midair so I can bounce off it here. I drop the P-switch so I can spin jump off the bottom, and I bonk it with my head for a midair Bounce. Then I go through this tornado so I can throw the spring and shell for a midair jump, and I use Yoshi and spit the pow so I can jump off at midair, and I do one last midair pow jump into the pipe. Now even though this level is only 30 seconds long, it took me around 23 hours to get all the tricks in one go, which is kind of a lot. So whenever I achieve something like beating a hard level, I like to celebrate by putting something up on my wall that symbolizes my achievement. So since this level had a tornado in it, I put a tornado on my wall. 